heat wave. It's being made even more difficult because of new water restrictions that are being put in place in San Diego and all across the state. The goal is to drop water use in California by 20%. Tonight, CBS 8's Brian White explains what that means for you. I'm here at the Public Utilities Department in Kearney Mesa where they want to see San Diegans do their part to conserve more water. Part of the new rules means no more of this. Washing your car at home is a water waster. But it's still okay to take your car to a commercial car wash. Commercial car washes are required to recycle their water, um, so they're very efficient operations. Director of the San Diego Public Utilities Department, Juan Guerrero, says the new rules also mean less of this. They want you to limit watering your lawn or landscape at home to three times per week, and that needs to be done before 10 a.m. or after 6 p.m. And after it rains, you shouldn't use your sprinklers again for another 48 hours. It's enough water to probably keep landscape um, healthy and looking good. Um, but again, it's just making sure we're just uh, being really water conscious. Right now, they're focusing on education rather than penalizing people. So why are we being asked to do this? California has been in a transition period from occasional drought to something that's really more like a transition to a warmer and drier climate. Janine Jones with the California Department of Water Resources says we're in the third year of a drought and precipitation this year across the state is at about three quarters of what we're normally used to. This year, the state water project allocation is uh, only 5% and the Colorado River Basin in the lower basin has a first ever lower basin shortage. But not to worry, because of smart planning, San Diego is in pretty good shape. By conserving water locally, we can import less, leaving more water for other areas in California that are in dire need. And so we can make sure we'll have enough water here in the years to come. It's important during a drought to think about not only your supplies right now, but also what is happening elsewhere to other supplies, to the environment, and having enough water for next year. In San Diego, I'm Brian White for CBS 8.